the y'all don't think tone don't matter? What? Like, 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 no, nah, nigga, like if I'm talking to you a certain way, you'll be like, hey, nigga, watch your mouth. Same thing oh, no, with the tone, girl. Yeah, tone definitely matters, but like you That's said, saying, you like, said like, it, you you said it best though. Talk, no, I'm saying you ever heard him talk. No, I'm yeah, saying this is what I'm saying though. You uh Oh, okay. So y'all agreeing? I got you. Yeah, we agree. But like you said, you 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 setting up the premise for like, if a woman don't find you attractive, bro, she gonna come with the same energy the same way. You you the first one that said it. Yeah, I was really gonna make that point. Um, I mean, no disrespect to the lady that was here before, but I mean, come on, like, ma'am, I don't want to argue with you. I ain't trying to argue with you either. You got it. What the fuck, I'm gonna argue with you for. See, I so, brother, you, you you hit the nail on the head, but. Hey man, you know, hey, you know, most niggas hey, ain't ain't DQ thing, model. Hey, hey my bad. Right. This is the last thing I'm gonna say. <laughs> so, beans. What happened? I asked the question. You were saying something for Kiki earlier. Did you need to finish it? I was hearing, but I no. I was just up. I was just defending her against Fantastic because I thought it was very odd that he tried to make a comment about her looks. Um, you know what I'm saying? The way that he looks, and you know, that's all that was. Like I just. I don't think that's. I mean, look, I get it. Like everybody say, they want to say this gladiator school and all that, but then you had niggas like Juan Solo crying when I invite niggas to Chicago. Mm. I thought it was gladiator school. I thought it don't matter what people say. I thought it was just the internet. So niggas should be able to say whatever they want to. But he came for Kiki. I don't like that. It's just that simple. Okay. What that's did he say? It don't he matter. It don't need to be repeated. Okay. Mill said, "Keep him off for another two minutes." He said, "I'm broke, baby. I ain't got no money." <laughs> so. Breaker, you can come racism. back at uh, five thirty-four. <laughs> they just do it too. Y'all ain't shit, yeah, racism. <laughs> Damn, man. Oh, my, my, my name, my name was called. Uh, what now? What, what, what did, what did Beans have to say? Something about looks. Absolutely, brother. I now know, I know. Don't want to have this. Content. I know, brother. You too short you and too fat to be talking about looks, content. brother. Brother, you, you too short and too fat to be talking about looks. You don't want to do this with me. You, That's you don't want to do this, with me, bro. this contest, bro. Like, Brother, you do not want to do this with me. You you know you're gonna lose so, this one. So you're gonna put your face in the camera and my face in the camera, and you're gonna tell me that. Oh yes, yes. Most so brother, 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 take the hat off. First off, take your hat off. We're gonna do this. <laughs> right, you're not gonna I'm take the hat off. You're gonna get down. Wait, because I'm ball take, headed. Oh what does that my mean? god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Brother, you don't have the testosterone. You don't have the height. You don't have the testosterone, you don't have height? the height, you don't have the BMI, or any of this stuff to do this to me, brother, Wait, please. You're saying that your height in the gym, you get in the gym for about two years, then come back to me, brother. So brother, stop it. You, you have okay, the man, you, you, you have the man I am, but twice my weight. Feminine. You have the man I am, but twice my weight, you brother. You don't want this smoke. Come on now. Nobody's picking you over me, dog. Stop it. Really? Stop, bro. You think so? And, 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 you don't really you brag so? about being on Section 8, my nigga? Ain't you on Section 8? You brag about being on Section 8? Stop See it. what I'm saying? What is that you have to do with your you want to do this. We, we, we joking, Absolutely. Right? You know so what that means? Bro. That means I have a place for a booster Oh, Nigga, don't get scared, nigga. Oh, nigga, don't don't get scared, nigga. Are you brag about being on Section 8, my nigga? We, we are not the same. We're not the same. We're not the same. We're not the same. Nobody is picking you, bro. Hey, actually, I have central air and central heat, too. So what the fuck that mean? Nigga, I'm happy you pay for it. You welcome. That mean in the summertime I can keep her cool, and in the wintertime I can keep her you know, warm, nigga. That's you know, what it means. Is, what is he talking Bill, about? Bill said, uh, <laughs> kick fantastic ugly ass off. I know he didn't. I know he didn't on God's green earth. This man actually so, think that he's more attractive than me. Mr. There's fantastic, no way, Mr. Fantastic can come back at 539, right? Yeah. Five thirty, no, yeah, five thirty nine. We're not going to have no handsome contest. Hey, listen, uh, just for the record, too, Tommy, I actually agree with that last take, and I actually really, 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 really appreciate you saying it out loud. I really do. Thank you. Hey, listen, I told you, I always, I speak a fact. I don't, I don't care who it is. Speak a fact. I'm gonna speak a fact, and I'm gonna back up what's right. Absolutely. Yo, Hink DZ put Frankie in the bathroom for another ten minutes. God, damn, damn. that poor fella. Why y'all doing that? Put him in the fucking bathroom. Get him out of here. Why y'all doing that to that man? You could come back and uh, all he did was let English whoop his ass for a few Why y'all doing him like that, G? No, he can come back. Hold on, let me tell him. He can come Brinka, you can come back at 5 45, bro. Whatever time that is. <laughs> I don't feel bad for that man. Right. All he did was not talk. Just hope good. they keep keeping him back then. <laughs> 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 he said, Yo, all man, he did I hope they keep doing good. it. I just 
so Mr. Fantastic, Mr. Fantastic, man, there was more ones than twos in the chat. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> so they they voted for Hank. Even Vince said one. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? You stupid. Should I? Am I supposed to say pause or no? <laughs> yeah, but you you get good. You old. That's hey, why did I got? Hey, 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 hey. Lonnie said, and I'm curious. Lonnie said that's strange. Hey, being comparing themselves to each other. I'm not saying whether it is or isn't, but I always wondered why is it that women can do certain things. And they claim that they're equal, but they love to try and put the gay jacket on men, no matter what it is men do. They're quick to throw a gay jacket on a man. If a, Women sit there and tell each other how nice they bust. If you go look at most of these Instagram videos of these girls walking and showing their ass, the majority of people in the comment section ain't even men anymore. If you go to a strip club, it's as many women or more in the strip club than men. So they Wait, gay I mean, as hell. You, you asked a question. What was the question? The question is, why is it that they quick to say what is gay that a man does, but apparently whatever they do is fine? Well, they say, they say, yo, well, uh, yeah, I don't know. That, that didn't seem gay to me. I don't know. It but doesn't seem like it's weird. You don't nigga know an ugly nigga. Why would you not know an ugly nigga or an attractive nigga? <laughs> that means you don't even know I'm broke, baby. Kid. I ain't got no money. Bullshit. Yo, Corey weird. Love I dropped the shining, 50 nigga. ball. Like, man, just walk I around and don't see anything money. when they see a big man. Like you Apple. got money? <laughs> Hold on. Let me, let me get this out the way. Corey Love dropped the 50 ball for the boy, Mr. Fantastic. He said, bring his ass back. Like that. Like that. Like that. Yo, it's fantastic they brought you back even though you had three more minutes left hey core i appreciate the love i think that's really what it was for you feel me? Shit like that shit like that shit like that shit like that so beans yeah unless unless mr fantastic come back then i gotta go back in the middle for the for the for the um nah they said we can't do that no more huh <laughs> they said we can't do that no more <laughs> So I asked a question. Tommy was there, but actually, this is good. Only Tommy was there when I asked the question on that night. Right. I think you came up, but it might have been late. But I asked the question, you know, and I, I kind of rehashed it. Um, what if if we don't get it together, men and women, and we go our separate black men and women, and we don't we don't get it together, and we go our separate ways, who gonna suffer more? So I feel like I wanted to rehash it with just so much over talking and all that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When we did it that night, you feel me? Uh, while you mold it over just a second, Mr. Fantastic with the $10 says, says niggas in 304 is mad over the truth. They don't like when men are honest about women's looks. Brings me back. I'm driving. When you back, bro, you also have, now you have a, uh, you got a, a $55 credit. So <laughs> you back. <laughs> Yo, nah, I think that, that's a very uh, disturbing question, man. Yo, yo, can you hear me? He back, yeah, he can hear you. <laughs> yo, let me let me say this real quick. Let me say this real quick. That's what I wanted to say. Child of Jonathan, now, and not this. This made me remember it, right, bro? Women are so like the same women that call you ugly and acclaim all these things. Whatever y'all claims in the chat, bro, you know you're not picking a nigga that's in motherfucking section eight over me. And then we ain't even talk about everything else, okay? But women will lie, bro. Women will lie and be like, you the ugliest nigga in the world. And hell, I'm pretty sure every man on this case that had this shit where I can't stand him, he ugly, he this. And then you get that bitch by herself and what's she doing? Swallowing your kids. So again, bro, you can't wow. trust a woman in anything when a, when, a woman, when a woman says publicly that a nigga is this, that, and the other, so on and so forth, because we know what she's going to do privately if, she, if you motherfucking get her by herself. Now again, women can talk about and call niggas ugly, all all times and days of the week. If a man says, I didn't even say shot is ugly. I just say, hey. God damn, man. They don't bro. <laughs> it's a fantastic <laughs> about it. Nah, man. Man, this, this is the thing <laughs> about it. Oh, so this is what I'm saying. Wait, wait, wait. Please up. let me say this. Huh? Please let me say this, uh, Ham. See, this is what I'm saying, right? Uh-huh. Bro, you know why everybody know I'm on Section 8? Because I said it. I, I did a show before I even I got it and, put, and asked everybody if they think I should do it, right? But this is what I'm saying. If a nigga come up and attack you for that, Hink, this ain't a shot. Well, it's a shot at Hink. Hink, Jonathan, Tommy, Hemp, nobody got nothing to say about that, right? I ain't never said that. Tommy, it's not personal. It's not personal. 
don't say nothing about your... It's not personal, Tommy. It's not personal. It's personal with you. It's not right? personal with you. But I'm saying nobody not going to say nothing about that at all. We pick and choose and cherry pick where we want to hold men accountable where this shit is funny. That's why the fucking women don't rock with you niggas like that, right? I don't give a damn if you get Section 8. It's probably my house you rent. I don't give a damn. But, but here's the thing, though. But here's don't the you thing, pay though. me my rent? I don't give a damn. Absolutely. Hey, That's all I got to say. I, I got to say this. Finish, man. Man. Oh, I never right. heard this before. Oh, no, you yeah, don't have to let you finish. Right? Now, when you I'm trying to talk, you're going to cut me off. You're going to say, 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 Absolutely, but that's not the Have point. But that's not the point. Yeah, that's not, he, well, not okay, wait. No, 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 that's cool. Hey, 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 right now, what you're doing is you playing I stupid. I changed you about Section 8, brother. I that's not what I said. That's not what I said. That's why you over-talking me. You over-talking me. You know if you're you allowed to go, the truth is going to come out. Why did you say my name in the situation? Because you didn't say shit. What am I supposed to say? I'm Why do you say anything about anything? Defend your goddamn self. Right, hey, so why didn't you keep your fucking mouth closed earlier when you call those bitches? I don't tell I said something was when y'all was derailing Hamp show and okay. y'all was going back and forth. That's okay. all the only time I said. Absolutely. So you're not, not, you're not stupid, bro. Damn, this your fault. Hink, you're not stupid, bro. Hank, you're not stupid, bro. You're not stupid. You understand exactly what I'm saying. You cherry pick when you want to hold men accountable for their actions, bro. That's some bitch ass shit. In okay. real life, if that nigga was standing in front of me where I'm at and said that shit to me, not only would niggas would roast him, but they would probably beat his ass. Because they're going to be like, you a hating ass niggas. Where I come from, niggas celebrate your win. They don't give a fuck what your win is. You understand? Only in this space do niggas try to cherry pick what they want to what they want to hold niggas accountable for. But Hink, that's not the point. The point is, is this, Hank. The point is, is this. Why you continue to over talk me. The point is, is this. What I'm saying is, is call out all the bitch ass shit or don't call out none of it that's my that's my only statement i ain't telling you what you got to do i'm saying keep it 100. at the end of the day kiki didn't say a motherfucking thing about fantastic bro at all see right now you being feminine you acting like a bitch over talking me hey miss fantastic see what i'm saying talk about this man being on section eight because if it hey if it weren't for section eight i would have one of my houses rented out so hey i'll i'll put everybody out to section eight you keep but, 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 but he but he going on listen your, your, your rent's doing about uh 12 days you absolutely absolutely it'll be taken care of but they talk bad about, about section eight two but things real quick real quick, quick tommy just let me land he's he gonna let me land he's gonna let me land right i'm trying to land two things he won't stop talking i never heard this section eight shit before hold on two things right so one kiki never said nothing about that man to my knowledge right and i rock with kiki she's a supporter of all of our channels bro so absolutely i'm gonna say something about him saying something about her it's not personal it's like i got beef with fantastic but i'm just gonna say something because i would say something about anything else that i don't like right so i'm gonna say something secondly fantastic you're absolutely wrong broke niggas fuck niggas that got money fuck they bitches all the time all the time, nigga. Have you ever heard the story about the pool boy, the milkman? All these broke ass niggas be out here laying pipe to all you six foot three nigga ass bitches. So you're absolutely wrong about that. Not me. I support hoes. Everybody know I support hoes. Well, the funny thing, wait a minute, I get in trouble for when I said it. But the funny thing about that is there's a lot of people out there that have no idea what Section 8 is. So Absolutely. I'm going to let them know. Section 8 is when you don't have to pay for where you stay. What's happening? Mm -mm -mm. Hey, hey, Section 8. <laughs> what, is, what is going on? I want to I wanna hear it. So, Man, being bro, what? what point were you making with the Section 8 thing, though? He brought it up. Were you not listening? Fantastic oh. brought it up. He came up because I said something oh, oh, about his oh. looks. And he said, I know you don't think you look better than me. You on Section 8. Wait, wait, wait. And wait nobody just, said, yo, that's the just, stupidest shit you could ever compare just, in your wait, life. <laughs> wait, the Section 8 thing is a real thing? Absolutely. How the fuck do they know that? Because I told the world I have my own channel, Amp. I talked about it but when I first got the letter saying that I was chosen. I did a show about it. I did a poll, asked everybody, do y'all think I should take this shit or not? 
Everybody was like, yeah, take that shit, but don't stay on it forever, shit like that, right? I have been, bro, I have literally been detailing my journey on YouTube since I've been here. I talk about my real life. I don't spend all my shows talking about everybody else's life. But why you, why, what made you want to do that shit though? Because I'm transparent, dog. I, and I like being transparent. I, I, the, my point is that we not all the same. We all different. So why can't you embrace a motherfucker on their journey? Embrace people on their journey. Now, if they being stupid or if they being harmful to other people, absolutely hold them accountable. But the rest of this shit, be dumbass ad hominems attack. We was talking about who looked better. And this nigga said, yo, Section 8. My nigga, I'm in my house right now on my MacBook computer using my motherfucking internet with the heat blowing. And I'm about to be sweating with this big ass hoodie on. And my fucking BMW outside that I got to go get fixed with my insurance, oh, nigga. Shit like that. I don't shit like that. about shit what you like nigga say about my money. That's why I said. You know this hamp, I didn't get mad when he brought up the Section 8. I get mad when people attack my intelligence, not my money. You can say whatever you want to about my money. Talk about your fuck your bitch. About it right now. But your my point was that he brought it up, Hank. You finna play dumb again. He brought it up, everybody. He brought it up, everybody. He brought it up, everybody. Brought it up. everybody. You got mad because he brought it up. You was I did okay get mad because he brought it up. That's the point. The nah, video was there. I'm gonna review on, it, and everybody's gonna know you're a lot of people. Matter of fact, you went to, even to the point of bringing me in. Like I give a damn about your section eight. I didn't bring you in because you don't care about the section eight. I brought you in because you didn't rent. check them for bringing it up. Oh, okay, yeah. Shame on you for shaming this man for being on section, section eight. Section eight. Make sure you have my money in twelve days, beans. Hold on, wait. I'm missing my man. You don't have to pay for it. Was you watching? Was you watching World Class? Was you watching the show just now? Man, uh, you know, you know, know, I get mad. Get on your own no, no, but he's he's saying he's saying you mad. You're still talking about it now. No, I'm I'm talking about it because I'm 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 responding to this nigga because this nigga disrespected Kiki. The government. I know. I get you somewhere. Help me pay my rent. Why are we doing that? Today? Yo, yo, God, God damn, boy, y'all make up, y'all fuck up a wet dream, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> big, 